gr 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 gradius or gradius however you want to pronounce it not sure i love this game <laughs> i suck at it though because this shit's hard i won't lie all right let's see let's kill some ships <coughs> yeah go 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 oh, oh power up power up power up so gradius is like uh, another game that i love playing in fact this is almost identical <clears throat> hell it might even be it life force was a game that i loved playing as a kid and and yeah i played gradius sure oh yeah i like let's see what is oh yeah you oh shit oh yeah you gotta press the b button to get your use your your power up so what you do is, is you pick these little red things up <coughs> i love speed up because you know you can't dodge all this bullshit with a slow ass bullshit ship Oh, shit, I didn't get that red thing. Fuck. <laughs> shit is intense. I, I, I could put in that... I wonder if... I bet I could never pull it off with this Xbox 360 controller that I'm playing with. But I could do the economy code for sure and get 30 lives and have a fair shot at beating this hard-ass game. This game's difficult, man. Oh yeah, red enemies give you like power ups and stuff, so that's always fun. Let's see. Nope, can't do that power up. I should have got that damn speed. Oh, son of a bitch! The monsters from Ninja Turtles make you, they rear their ugly head. And yeah, it's one of those games where when you die, you are reminded uh, dying is not an option. You lose all your shit if you die. <laughs> go go power up. Oh no, go go torpedo. Or I don't even know if I lost all my, my power ups. I think. I think I got at least one here. Just give me that speed up. Alright, let's see. Oh, oh, oh. Them dudes on the ceiling make me nervous. Oh, I couldn't get down there fast enough, but I'm working on it. I'm working on my speed up. <coughs> Ball stop. Don't let the volcano fucking shit hit you. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Get up to the top. I don't even know if I'm supposed to do anything. I don't know. I did do what I was supposed to do. I, I didn't die, so that's always a it's always a plus. <laughs> Boss time! Boss time! I'm missing. I'm sucking it. I'm definitely. You got to hit him right in the middle. Hit him right in the middle, dude. You're not hitting him where you're supposed to hit him. <clears throat> when he comes by, you just spank his ass. It's all about hitting him in the right spot. There we go. I whipped his ass. Woo woo! Beat that first boss, and then we go. We transition right onto the next stage. No, not even a load screen, son. You see that shit, boy? Oh, I'm hauling ass now. Now I'm going so fast, I'll probably just run into shit because I'm just going too fast. <laughs> yeah, I probably shouldn't have powered that up. Probably should not have done that. I remember when the Super Nintendo version of this game came out. Shit, it was like Gradius 3 or something like that. This shit was hard. Oh, I got... I was too busy watching spaceships. And not what I was supposed to be watching. Give me my speed up. Take my speed up. Shit. I fucking sucked it up. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Y'all dead. We got to shoot them out. And it sucks. Those things in the middle of the stage. If you hit them, you die. Everything kills you. Just just assume everything fucking kills you. That's that's the that's the way it goes in these games. Double. Oh, oh wait, that's not what I thought it was. Never mind. I gotta get that laser. Gotta get that laser. That laser is is the bee's knees. Oh shit! You know what else is the bee's knees? Not getting hit by shit. That's also the bee's knees. Come on now, give me them power ups. Give me them beautiful power ups. I'll take the speed up. Just a little bit of speed. Not! Motherfucker! Are you serious? <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. Up, up, down, down. B, A, B, A. Select. Start! Oh, I had it on two players. Oh, don't worry, though. I didn't get the code right. So, there's that. <coughs> yeah, I got a power up. Alright. Yep, yep, here we go, here we go. Ah, I didn't get that power up, though. 
Give me that missile. You gotta have a missile. You gotta shoot shit on the ground. For sure. And I don't think there is a continue. I think when you get a game over, you're you're shit out of luck. You're go you're starting all the way over. I, I believe. Get that double. Gotta get oh yeah, now I'm shooting shit on the ceiling without having to get all up in their business. Yeah. Oh shit, I missed that power up though. That sucked. Oh, 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 oh shit. Yeah, here we go, here we go, here we go. Alright, nope, we don't want to speed up. For sure don't want that fucking speed up. I don't want to... I'll just run into bullshit, man. It just fucking sucks running into shit. <coughs> <coughs> Alright, got that power up. I want that fucking... Oh, the option. The option's what you want. The option's what you want. See, when I get to the option, you'll see why you want the option. I think... I think it's option. I don't know if it's a fucking question mark. <coughs> Maybe a question... I don't know. I don't know what the question mark is. But. There's the fucking laser. Fuck it. I'm getting the laser. <clears throat> that laser's fucking crunk, dude. Oh, shit. But I don't have my top shot. What? Oh, that's not good. I don't like that at all. boss fighting that laser is an annoying sign <coughs> I can tell you right now this game this game is the best third-party game up to this point this is I think we're still in 1986 I gotta check <coughs> I gotta check my, my game list uh, this is I want to say this is the first Konami or Konami game <coughs> I'm not sure well my turret center just went off there for a sec I think this is the first Konami game, but I'm not entirely 100% sure, but it is better than anything Capcom has given so far. That's for a fact. <coughs> I don't remember the laser being this sucky. I feel like the regular bullets were better. I think the, the laser was better because it, it goes through enemies. I believe that was the... Getting that option there. Getting that option. I kind of want that double bag. Yeah. You see me clear that whole line out right there? Yeah, that's why the laser's badass. It just fucking clear shit. You see that? You see this? <coughs> option. Two of these bitches. And look, I'm going to get another one too. I'm going to get another option. If I can. Oh, if it'll let me. Oh, shit. If it'll. Oh, fuck. Oh. Oh, shit. Oh, it's the second player. I can't. Ah. Fuck. I don't have the second controller. Handy. It's fucking hilarious. Fall. Command. Command. Reset. Up, up, down, down. Wait. Up, down, up, down. B, A. Select, start. That is not right. Yeah, that's definitely not right. We gon' we gonna put this on the pause right quick and look at this instruction manual. Look over here. <coughs> How to play Gradius Konami. Congratulations on your purchase of Gradius, another in the proud lineup of Konami's carefully researched high precision computer games. For maximum enjoyment for maximum enjoyment it is recommended that you read this instruction manual so you know what the fuck's going on. The story. The planet Gradius, a peaceful Earth-like world, is now under all-out space attack from their old nemesis beings from the subspace star cluster of Bacterion. The people of Gradius are in danger of being completely destroyed by the amoeboid Bacterion. <coughs> to save them, you have just launched the prototype hyperspace fighter, the Warp Rattler. The entire galaxy awaits your duel to the death with evil Bacterions. Your objective is the Bacterion Superfortress, Zarius. Or Zerus, however you pronounce it. <laughs> to reach this, you must steal the enemy power capsules along your route and boost the Warp Rattler's <coughs> hyper powers. You are the last hope for the general gentle people of Gradius. You will need all your courage and concentration to win. Get ready to blast off. How to play. Your mission is to pilot the Warp Rattler in the enemy space and destroy Zerus. You are the only one left who can return peace to the planet Gradius. <laughs> it is necessary for you to avoid enemy fire and destroy the hordes of alien bacterion craft. 
that will come out to attack you as you proceed through the various stages of the game. Gradius can be played either by a single player or by two players. If there are two players, the play alternates from player to player. You can't play at the same time. Uh, let's see. Then it tells you what the controller does. Of course, you know, basic shit. All right, power booster. <laughs> power boosting. Each time you capture a red-colored enemy power capsule, the series of power boost selection indicators will light up at the bottom of your screen. <laughs> Speed up. Uh, when desired indicator lights up, hit the power boost button, the button B, uh, to activate that power boost. Alright, <coughs> one is speed up, increases your speed. Two is missile, equips you with air to surface missiles. Three, double, uh, equips you with double beam cannons, effective against enemy attacks from above. Laser powers the warp rattler with a high penetration laser beam cannon. Uh, five, option, doppelganger capability option. This spins off a ghost like twin of the warp rattler, the sidewinder. The Sidewinder has all the original firepower of the Warp Rattler and follows you in formation <coughs> during your attacks. You may create a maximum of two Sidewinders. The Sidewinder duplicates the Warp Rattler's original firepower, has missile, double, and laser attack capability. Ah, <coughs> yawning, yawning, yawning. Force field barrier. <coughs> this power boost effect equips the Warp Rattler with a force field barrier, making you invulnerable to enemy attack. <coughs> when the barrier turns red, this means that you only have enough force field power to protect you from one more attack. <coughs> you may have multiple power boost effects at the same time. However, the double beam <coughs> cannon and the laser cannon cannot be used together. And that sucks. Under attack from the space invader. This is small. The volcanic stage. Originally, this was a green and peaceful satellite. But now, under attack of the Xavius Space Forces, it has been transformed into an Inferno-like advanced base for the alien Zerus. The Stonehenge Stage. This is an artificially constructed asteroid belt created as a galactic fighter base. The invented space volcano st inverted space volcano stage. Like Stage 1, this is an enemy planetoid advanced base, but this time up and down have become reversed. The Moai Stage. The Moai are great are great strange heads that resemble the old stone statues of Easter Island on Earth. They were created by an unknown race eons ago in the image of the patron spirits of the galaxy. <laughs> the Zavus forces have utilized these as bases for <laughs> the antinoid stage. <laughs> Giant living tentacle like antenna, antenna, antennae. Antenna floating through space, they <coughs> sense the presence of another living being. They shoot out deadly po uh, poison capsules. Can't read because it's so small. The amoeboid stage. High amoeba like organisms from unknown reaches of space. They're primitive but have incredibly strong <coughs> uh, idle, for idle force and will pursue relentless relentlessly uh, any life forms. Make it bigger. Make it bigger. <coughs> Any life form that invades their living space. The Zeru Super Fortress stage. The ultimate stage of the game. This fortress lies at the very heart of the nerve center of the Bacteriot Empire. <coughs> it's controlled by a complex biocomputer. Here's what your screen will look like. Your warp rattler, barrier, force food. <laughs> it tells you all the shit. <coughs> it's whatever. You'll see it when I play it. If you haven't seen it already. Alright, characters and components of the game. The Warp Rattler. He gets laser shit. Yeah, he gets a little diagram. Missile <laughs> missile banks. Canopy. Radar. Yeah, pretty cool with length 40. I like this information. <laughs> so the ship is 50 foot long. 50, 51 feet wide. <coughs> its height is 21, 20 feet. It weighs 38 tons. Uh, it has an impulse power drive as an engine. <coughs> and it has beam laser missile and two options. Let's see, and here's some point. Enemy power capsule, uh, red, 500 points, and you get power. A fan, uh, it's a neutral zone patrol craft, <coughs> it's 100 points. A Ruger, uh, standard GVS fire. oh, that's the enemies. Garen, uh, the Dacker, that's the little, little dudes on the ground. <coughs> Jumpers, uh, Dyes, uh, Zabs, Foss, Rash, <coughs> Venus, Uska, Tilde, Amoeba, Mazar, 3,000 points. Uh, it's a mid-sized ring powder. Dagoom, 1,000 points. Enemy scramble hatch. Antinoid, <coughs> destroy the heart. <coughs> it must be a boss. 
Uh, let's see, Xavier's big core fighters. That's the big bosses. Cool deal. Uh, helpful hit. Hit with it. <laughs> the gameplay of Gradius are ways to obtain bonus points and to perform extraordinary maneuvers. The keys to get bonus points and to perform these maneuvers are buried within the program. Hopefully you will be able to discover these in the playing of this game. We would appreciate hearing from you. If and when you do discover some of these, we will give you one hint. It is possible to warp through a stage if you fulfill certain conditions. <coughs> I don't know how to do that. <laughs> Advance, attack, and defense maneuvers. Attack the red enemy craft without letting them escape. Then steal their power glove cap. Power power glove capsules. Power capsules. Pay careful attention to the power boost selection indicators at the bottom of your screen. Choose the appropriate power boost considering the stage you're in at the top. <coughs> the enemy projectiles are intelligent weapons. They will anticipate your flight path and follow your escape maneuvers. Be careful not to get caught <coughs> napping, like I did several times. When you are in the volcanic stage, it is not enough just to escape from the volcanoes. Use your laser cannon and doppelganger option to <coughs> blast the rocks for a higher score. If you can get one of the special blue power capsules, all the enemies visible on your screen will be destroyed at once. Watch out for the enemy daggers. They will appear suddenly, attacking from both above and below, out of left and out of the left side of the screen. <coughs> Use the doppelganger option to, uh, bl to blast the Mazar spheres with the Sidewinder's extra firepower. <sighs> Will you run <laughs> into an antinoid creature <coughs> after the red spheres and the arm portions? Blah, 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 blah. <coughs> Treat your Konami game carefully. <coughs> oh, and it lets you write your scores down. And that's it. <coughs> that's a Konami instruction right now. <coughs> Let's play this. Way to suck it up there, dude. Jesus Christ. My God. <coughs> I sucked. Oh my God. Thank you. Oh God. I went, I got the worst power up. I needed that damn missile. Needed that missile. Should have had the missile. Got the missile. All right. Cool. We 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 in town. Uh, we we good to go. We good to go. Or not. I don't know. I gotta dodge these damn bullets and dodge all these damn sh shit. <coughs> it ain't the bullets. It's the damn ships. Sons of bitches. Jesus. The damn jumpers. Some bitches is impossible to get to because of where they're at. They're right around all them damn mountains. I thought I was gonna bite it there for a second. Man. God dog it, I can't get a good angle on anything. Give me the speed up. Just give me the speed. Fuck! Did you see all those damn bullets coming at me? Holy shit. <coughs> you gotta be shitting me. Alright, oh, 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 here we go, here we go, here we go. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh, 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 no. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Let's go ahead. Oh, wait, here we here we here here we All right, yeah, we got the missile. Cool, we're going to shoot shit on the ground now. Probably get our ass beat by shit not on the ground. Got that speed up. Got that speed up, boy. We're going to have that speed up. We're not going to get our ass outpaced. We're not going to get too much speed up. We don't go too fast. All right. <laughs> Let's see. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Okay, volcano time. It's whatever. I'm gonna sit my ass right here and just pow, 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 pow. Stupid volcano stage. <laughs> I swear if I die to some bullshit, I'm gonna get pissed off. I think it's just a chance to get points and shit. I don't fucking know. It's stupid though. Boss time. Why can't the boss drop power ups? <laughs> it's like he shoots bullets at the same same spot. <coughs> I'm just gonna sit right here and shoot and just hold my bullets. Yep, I'm just gonna sit right here. <coughs> Smoke his ass. He was easy. That's the easiest, easiest boss fighting ever. 
I want that laser in my life. Oh shit! Oh shit! Dip up! It just came out of nowhere. All right, here we go. We got lasers now. We got lasers now, boy. Ooh, son, we got lasers now. We are laser up. Oh shit! I didn't get my power up that time though. Got my power up that option, baby. Two lasers. You can't. You can't argue with two lasers. You can't argue with two lasers. You cannot argue with two lasers. There's nothing wrong with two fucking lasers. Ooh, there's a lot of bullets. That's a lot of fucking bullets. Dude, that damn turret right there. Oh my god, that turret could suck my ass. Okay, we don't want a double. All right. Oh yeah, but we do want that to kill everything. Yeah, that's the best thing ever. shoot this turret we're gonna shoot that turret all right we're gonna get our second option oh now we really balling watch me not even get a chance to use this shit oh, shit shit oh shit oh shit oh there was too many bullets i don't know what i could have done <coughs> oh fucking game over i got two options had all this nice neat shit and they're like game over up up down down left right left right b a Alright, anyway. Let's look at the Wikipedia for Gradius. Gradius is a horizontally scrolling shoot 'em up video game developed and published by Konami, the first game in the Gradius series. It was originally released as a coin operated arcade game in 1985. The player maneuvers a spacecraft known as the Vic Viper, definitely not what the instruction manual calls it, that must defend itself from the various alien enemies. The game uses a power up system called the Power Meter. Based upon collecting capsules and purchased uh, uh, capsules to purchase additional weapons, the arcade version of Gradius was released internationally outside of Japan under the title of Nemesis. Uh, on those subsequent home releases of the original title, home versions were released for various platforms such as the NES, the MSX home computer, and the PC Engine. Gameplay. Gameplay. Let's see. The player ship the Vic Viper, exchanging shots with the enemy Moa in the game's third stage. <laughs> the player's power meter is toward the bottom of the screen. Yeah, that must be the arcade. The player controls the transmission of spaceship Vic Viper. Uh, let's see. <laughs> the, uh, and must battle waves of enemies through various environments. The game became synonymous with the phrase destroy the core. As the standard boss of boss battles in the Gradius series involved combat with a giant craft. In the center of which would be situated one to several blue colored spheres. These bosses would be designed in such a way that there would be straight up passage to the exterior of the craft from the exterior of the craft, <laughs> which leads directly into one of these cores. The player must fire shots into this passage while avoiding attack patterns from weapon emplacements <coughs> on the body of the boss. However, small but destructible walls are situated in this passage, impeding the bullet shots from damaging, core, from damaging the core and must be whittled away by repeat well-placed shots in a way these tiny walls represent the boss's shield engage until its core is finally vulnerable to attack. <laughs> Some bosses have the ability to regenerate these walls. <laughs> when the core has stand enough hits, it usually changes color from blue to red, indicating that it is in critical condition and its destruction is imminent. Upon the destruction of a core, the piece of the a piece of the boss may be put out of commission, seeing that it is no longer powered by a core, or if all of the cores are destroyed, the entire boss is defeated and explodes satisfyingly. Note that these cores are not present in the more organic bosses of Gradius. Such bosses have weak spots in places such as the mouth, head, or eye. <clears throat> when gameplay begins, the Vic Viper is relatively slow and has only a weak gun. This level of capability is generally insufficient for engaging enemies, but the Vic Viper can gain greater capabilities by collecting and using power-up items. While most arcade games utilize distinct power-up items that each correspond to a specific effect on the player character, Gradius has a single power-up item. <coughs> The effect of this power-up item is to advance the currently selected item in a power-up menu that appears at the bottom of the screen. When the desired power-up is highlighted, the player can obtain it by pressing the power-up button during the menu, returning to the menu <coughs> to its initial state to which no power-up is highlighted. Development. Creation of Konami game designer Machiguchi Hiroyasu uh, being the first video game he publicly released. Joining the company in the early 1980s, originally as a programmer, Konami was trying to transition from being a producer of metal machines to a video game developer, and assigned him to a small team to try and create a game that could be part that could put the company on the map. 
He asked the team what kind of game they'd like to work on, responding that they'd like to make another shooting game. The shoot 'em up genre had seen a resurgence at the time with Namco Xevious, uh, but the goal of the project uh, being to make the shooter that could surpass it. The project was at first intended to be a follow-up to Konami's earlier game, Scramble, <coughs> being titled Scramble 2 and reusing many of its material and game mechanics. Uh, development lasted for about a year, <coughs> which Hiroyasu says was filled with anxiety and worry from the production team due to it being their first game, lacking confidence in what they were doing. All right, yeah, just a lot of, <coughs> a lot of stuff. Then was produced for the Konami Bubble System arcade hardware. Yeah, okay. <coughs> Slots and stuff, lots of stuff. Let's see, the first home version of Gradius was released for Nintendo's Famicom console on April 25th, 1986 in Japan. Due to the hardware limitations of the Famicom, many of the level designs were simplified. The Mosses, for example, likes the vertical scrolling present in the arcade game, and the maximum amount of options that the player can upgrade was reduced from 4 to 2. Ooh, I want 4. <laughs> <coughs> this version added a cheat code that can be entered while the game is paused that grants the player's ship almost all the power of <coughs> This code would appear again in many later Konami and many later Konami on the NES and other consoles just kind of be known as the economy code. Oh, look, this the economy code. <coughs> you do it while you pause. <coughs> the NES version of Gradius was released in North America in December of not December. This is, this is a Christmas present, y'all, of 1986. It is the first NES game to have been released by Konami in the region. Yep, there you go. It's the first Konami game. And unlike the original arcade game, the title was kept unchanged between regions. The NES version was made available in arcades as a Nintendo Versus system board, blah, 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 blah. <coughs> That's about it. <coughs> Let's see, yep. Oh, okay. yeah. Cool deal. Review time. Let's see what Nintendo Life says about it. <laughs> it's so hard to review a game like Gradius. This is a near legendary title and has inspired a franchise. But when reviewing the classic retro titles, you have to judge if the game is still worth playing again. Thankfully, Gradius is a game that has aged much better than. Definitely. 7 out of 10 more like 10 out of 10. The game's perfect. I just hate that the 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 game over when you get a game over you start all over is just <coughs> fucking wank. Oh I did see this thing. Like uh Oh, and the rather unhealthy fixation with Easter Island statues is both confusing and entertaining. <coughs> yeah, because aliens made those damn things, right? <coughs> That's what I figured. Anyway, <coughs> there's that. Let's 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 do this shit. Uh, first I'm gonna go ahead and pop something right quick. Konami code. <laughs> I want to make sure I'm not going crazy. Let's see. What is the famous Konami code? Oh, look at that. They're not going to tell me what it is. <laughs> this is going to be. Up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right. B, A. All right. Let's do this. <laughs> up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right. B, A. Nope, I did that wrong. Up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right, B, A. Oh, what? Did you see that? That awesome cheating ass shit I just did? What? That was perfect. Perfect. We are about to wreck this shit, son. So basically, you can just, you can just throw that damn force field out every time you want to do this shit, huh? <coughs> just cheat, cheat. Cheat, 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 Get that laser. Get your laser, son. Oh, yeah. Let's go ahead and get that one little speed up. I don't want to go much faster than this. I don't want that double. Did I crash into the fucking ceiling? Hey, up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right, B, A. Oh, oh, shit, I fucked up. Up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right, B, A. Bam. Didn't work that time. <laughs> up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right, B, A. I guess it only works one time. That's hilarious. Let's try it again. Up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right, B, A. Yep, it only works one time. That's, well, it's, it's just a cheapo move. <laughs> nope, it does not work. Bam, 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 bam. Nope. No bueno. <coughs> T 
to verify that it doesn't work. I got a game over. But we're going to try it again. We're going to try it again. Let's see. Up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right. B, A, B. Yeah. Yeah. It works one time. And I shat the bed with it. Which is kind of funny. <coughs> game is hard. It's, 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 it's difficult. I may have to give it a 9 out of 10 just because of how hard it is. But, I don't know. I mean, it's hard to fault a game for being too hard. I mean, it's not like... I don't know. It's not like it's not fun. I mean, I enjoy it. Ooh, 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 gotta get that jumper. Yeah, we, we, we in reverse now, huh? I want that damn laser, son. I want that laser. Actually, you know what I want? I want that damn, uh... <coughs> fuck a laser. I want that damn, uh, double. Yeah, I got it. We got bullets going every direction, now. Huh? We got up, down, sideways. We got them all going, now. Huh? We gonna whoop that ass. This is probably the longest video that I've solo shot. Oh, yeah, here we go. Sweet. I wish the missiles. I wish you could get missiles that went up <coughs> and they followed the ceiling. That would be. That would be. That would be awesome. I don't want no lasers. I don't even care about power ups, man. I got everything I want right now. <coughs> the laser's good for fetching power. -ups. I'll just go ahead and say that the laser's good for fetching power ups. Oh, yeah. Bomb the shit out of them. Them volcano boulder things yeah <coughs> oh we got another power up to get on that shield yeah I need to get uh, a few more power ups to get on the shield at the very least <coughs> good old economy code coming in to save the day yeah see my options are just following me around son oh son I almost ate shit on this boss Hey, that boss is definitely not doing what he did a while ago. He is, he's changing it up some. Woo, you see me, son? I fucking, my, my shield kind of came in for, for me on that. Oh shit, my shield's, my shield's in trouble. <coughs> my shield's red. No, <coughs> my shield's red. I don't want my shield to die. Good deal, good deal, good deal. Bad deal, bad deal, bad deal. Ah, fuck. I didn't kill that thing. Dude, did I just shit all over that or what? There, now I don't need any more power-ups. Yeah, don't need any more power-ups. I just need to kill shit and be happy. Kill shit, be happy. Kill shit, be happy. Am I going to make it? Hell yeah, I'm going to make it. Oh, shit, that was a lot of bullets, son. Yeah, give me that damn force field. <coughs> Keep them power-ups going. I guess I could look up how to do this, this warp thing that the game was like. The, the manual was saying, oh, there's a trick you can use to to warp all the way to the end of the stage. You know, you could really show off to your friends. Or some shit like that. I don't know. <coughs> Let's, oh, 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 shit, yeah, boy. What? What? Look at all them power-ups. It's like a bastion of power-ups. I'm going to stay right there. That's my force field, son. Gotta keep my force field alive. Oh yeah, clear the way, clear the way there, bullets. Oh yeah, here we go. These are some annoying assholes. Hey, <laughs> we gonna whoop this dude's ass. <coughs> Get my ass whipped. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit, Craig. Damn, I was not ready for this. I was not ready for this. I was definitely not ready for this. So theoretically, if you could, if you could take it, 
to the limit, you could totally, like, keep the shield up. <coughs> if you could keep all your options up, <coughs> get all your options, get all your bullets, your doubles or whatever, and keep the shield going, you could probably do it. You just got to hold on to the power-ups. Damn! I just ate a ton of shit. See, like, you're not, you're not doing, you're not doing the damn thing if you're doing what I just did. And that's pretty much just letting this boss rail your ass. <laughs> I whipped his ass over. <laughs> I gotta get five power-ups. I got to get five power -ups. If I die, I'm done. If I die, I'm turning this shit off. Alright, let's see, let's see. Oh, oh, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Lots of, lots of baddies, lots of baddies, lot, lots of shit, lots of shit going on. Oh, there's a lot of shit on the screw. <coughs> oh, lordy. Oh, what the hell is this? Damn. Oh, it took all my, oh, I didn't have a shield. That's right. Okay, let's see. We're going to get this power up. There we go. We, we invincible now. So there's the Easter Island head dudes. Didn't kill these dudes, so did it. The, the the little thing that's supposed to kill everything. Oh, I got a one up. I got a one up. So that's that's awesome. Those are apparently fucking rare dude. Ooh. <clears throat> I told you if I was dead, I, I was done. I just let it die out. Hey, this is Gradius. This is one of the best games on the NES, and it just spawns more and more games like this <coughs> over time. Uh, there's not a ton of them, but the ones that do come out, you know, battle or, or, or not battlefield shit. 1942 is your first shoot 'em up game. <coughs> this is the first time <coughs> you really get one, and it's like it feels complete. It feels like Konami really put the work in for it. <coughs> I really like it. Uh, anyway, if you like the video, hit like, hit subscribe. Please excuse the. Uh, the, the random noises, the ticks, blah, blah, blah. I was not focused on keeping those down. I was just <coughs> enjoying the game. <coughs> Peace out.